Welcome to Congleton, a market town with a population of around 26,900 located in Southeast Cheshire, well known for its festivals, flowers, ribbons and bears. Right at the heart of the town is Congleton's Town Hall, which is an impressive Victorian Gothic style building. Inside is equally impressive with three great rooms available to hire. The rooms range in size from the Grand Hall, which is able to accommodate weddings, concerts, parties, conferences and funeral services for over 300 people, to smaller meeting rooms for events between 10 and 70 people. The current Town Hall was built in 1864 and opened in July 1866. Designed by Edward William Godwin, the design was based on Northampton Town Hall and built to impress and reflect Congleton status. It embodies Italian and French Gothic design with an imposing stone staircase and a two-storey grand hall with exposed hammer beams, minstrels gallery and mansard ceiling. We have many treasures housed at the Town Hall and Museum where you'll find a wide collection of civic artifacts, charters and town treasures. We are very proud of this collection and are excited to share some interesting facts about a few of these treasures with you today. The Silver Gilt Mace was acquired in 1651 and has an intriguing historical connection with the execution of King Charles I. It is reputed to have been used as a model in the House of Commons. An inscription around the head of the mace originally said, the freedom of England by God blessing restored. In 1660, King Charles II regained the throne and the inscription was considered subversive. Town accounts of 1661 refer to a sum of three pound being paid to ye goldsmith for altering ye mace. The date was changed, somewhat clumsily, from 1651 to 1661 and the phrase to CR, short for Charles Rex, was added to the inscription. These alterations can be seen clearly today. This treasure is regularly used at the full council meetings where it is displayed on the top table and also at the mayor making and civic parade and service. Otherwise the artifacts are safely locked away and shown on invitation only or at other historical events in the town hall. The mayoral chain comprises five gold and enamel shields, 19 gold shields, eight gold open work links, one gold medallion and one pendant with diamond. The mayoress's chain comprises a crown, one large and three small diamonds and is a replica of James I's seal. It has been worn by mayors and mayoresses throughout the years. Congleton possesses two interesting and historic civic maces. These were, and still are, symbols of the Town Council's civic power and authority. The older of the two dates back from 1625 and is made of silver. This mace bears the coat of arms of James I and is probably one of the two maces mentioned in his charter of 1625. This charter was very important in the development of the town as it confirmed Congleton as a free borough forever and established the system of local government which was to remain until the passing of the Municipal Corporations Act in 1835. This remaining silver mace is probably the catchpoles as the other was sold to assist with the purchase of the later silver gilt mace. We also have many more artefacts at the Town Hall and Museum, including volumes of the town's charters, accounts and audits, 
some dating as far back as the 13th century. If you would like more information on the town hall, its treasures or the town itself, please visit the Town Council website or follow us on social media for more updates.